Hey, what's going on Kings and Queens? Rogue here from Team Rogue Gaming. So, since this is my first gameplay of Call of Duty Ghosts, I thought I'd talk about it for a second. So, uh, here's a picture of the class I'm using in this gameplay. You know, the game's kind of new. A lot of people are still trying to figure out what to use. I am really liking the Honey Badger, and the thing that makes this class so great for me is the Tracker site. If you haven't used it, I definitely recommend you try it out, dude, because... As you'll see in this gameplay, it helps me out so many times. Like, what you do is when you aim down the tracker sight, is it highlights the, the dudes in orange, so it makes it really easy to kill them. And it's just like, you know, after using the tracker sight, I don't even want to use just, like, regular iron sights or any other kind of sight. It's almost kind of like when I went gay. I mean, like, once you start dating guys, you never want to go back to girls. <laughs> okay, um, anyways, you guys voted on the Facebook page. Uh, for, like, I listed a few video ideas, and you guys all wanted me to tell the story about the time where I scared the off out of my mom, okay? So this happened actually a couple years ago, and I don't know why I haven't ever made a commentary about it. I just kind of thought it was not that important. But, uh, there's two things you need to know before I tell you this story. Number one, when I get out of the shower, the, the mirror is all steamy and stuff. I'm sure that happens to everybody. I always write and draw on it. I don't know why I always have, you know, I'll probably draw a set of balls or, uh, you know, just something for the next person who goes to the bathroom. I don't know. It's always something that I've done. It's a little tradition of mine. And the second thing you got to know, I don't know if this happens to anybody because at my mom's house it happens and at my dad's house it doesn't. When I draw something on the mirror, it stays there for a few days. So whenever somebody goes to take a shower after that, they see my nice little image that I drew for them. Anyways, one morning when I got out of the shower, I decided to write in big, bold letters, get out, okay? And I really had no intentions of doing this, like I didn't want to, well, I don't know, maybe I wanted to, but I really didn't expect this to actually scare anybody. I just thought, okay, I'm going to write get out, and when my brother comes in here after me, he's going to see it and freak out or something. But he didn't, he thought nothing of it, and he didn't even say anything. Um... But the next day, I went to my dad's house, and that's just kind of how it works. My parents are divorced. We spend time at both houses, and so I don't know this at the time, but my mom actually took a shower in our bathroom for some reason because her shower wasn't working, and when she got out of the shower, she sees in big letters, get out. So my mom at the time thinks that when she's in there taking a shower, Somebody came in and wrote get out on the mirror. So she's home alone, obviously. There's nobody else at my mom's house. And me and Austin are over at my dad's house. So she's like freaking out. You know, that's kind of one of those horror movies where you're like taking a shower and then like somebody comes in and stabs you. But obviously that didn't happen to my mom. But she gets out of the shower and sees this really, you know, she sees somebody wrote get out. And it freaks her out. And my mom isn't really like a superstitious lady, so she didn't think it was like a ghost or anything. But my mom freaked out, okay? She left the house immediately, and she booked a hotel for that night. And it ended up costing her, you know, like $200 or whatever it cost for a hotel one night. And I actually didn't find out about this for a couple of days, because when I went back there... Uh, my mom told us this whole thing like it was this huge deal. She's like, guys, I don't mean to freak you out, but somebody came in the house when I was here and wrote get out on the mirror. And I was like, oh my God. Mom, I got you so good. <laughs> and it was this really funny thing. And um, it was just, she was really mad at me actually at the time because uh, obviously I made her pay $200 because she had to go stay in a hotel, and she thought I did it on purpose and stuff, and I spent a whole bunch of time trying to convince her that I just did it for fun, I didn't really think about it, and yeah, I really, really scared my mom, and it was a good time, and you know what you should do? You should try to pull this prank too. Go into your parents' bathroom, and on the mirror, right, get out, so when they, or actually, that's kind of hard to do, I don't know, but it's a good prank idea, okay? Just letting you guys know. I love you, kings and queens, and I hope you leave a like. Hopefully, you enjoyed the gameplay and stuff. Uh, see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!
Royal Gilly. 